Hi everyone! In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to pay your Pag-ibig um, housing loan using your GCash. So if you're interested to know all about this, please keep on watching. Okay, let's go ahead and start so firstly you have to ensure you have cashed in the amount that you would use to pay for your pag-ibig housing loan and um, to cash in you can either go to uh, 7-eleven or check out all these avenues on how you could cash in so there's a lot here so pure gold SM Robinson, you can cash in through pawn shops. You have uh, different payment facilities, 7 Eleven. And then also, you can cash in via um, online banking. So, these are the banks. So, what I actually use is my debit card, which is connected to my gcash account so that it would be easier so this is my like my payroll atm so that when i receive my pay i could just transfer the money over here enter the amount and then process the cash in so that's the most convenient way for me however if you don't have any atm that you could link to this gcash account then you could always use these other cash in facilities available um, near you there's also remittances or paypal if you have paypal <clears throat> okay so now we're gonna jump into paying our pag-ibig <clears throat> pag uh, housing loan bill and so what i'm gonna do is to click pay bills it's on the second row pay bills all right and then under government you can find pag ibig so choose pag ibig and then just choose among the types of pag ibig payments you're gonna make so in this case i'm gonna choose housing loan and then just enter the account number the amount period covered and your email address so to make things easier what i did was to save all these details through add a biller here and then i looked for pag ibig and then what i did is to ent already enter all the details like the account number so that later when i would pay every month i would not need to enter all of the details all over again okay so here it is i will just click pag ibig and then as you can see everything's entered here already i would just change the i would just need to change the period covered because i will pay for the current month so what i would just do is to click pay bill and there as you can see everything's all entered except for the amount so i'm gonna enter the amount and then change the period covered because i'm paying for my august bill so i'm gonna choose july to august okay all right so everything's already filled out so i'm gonna click next and here's the confirmation page that I'm about to pay the amount for my Pag-ibig housing loan. So let me click confirm. Okay, so now it is processing. Let's just wait for it to there. 
So here's the receipt of my payment. I also receive an SMS and then later on I would also receive an email. Um, so using the download button on the upper right, I could save my receipt. See, receipt save. It goes to my gallery and that's basically it. That's how easy it is to pay your pag-ibig bills. So instead of you going to the... <laughs> Uh, pag-ibig offices or bayad centers um, and fall in line it's easy to have gcash and just pay through gcash so if you don't have one yet i have a referral code down at the description box you could use that referral code so that you could get an initial amount of 50 pesos on your gcash when you download it from from Play Store or if you're using an iPhone if you download it from the the Apple Play Store whatever so so there I also have other videos on how to pay my Meralco bill how to pay my SSS loan um, so just check it out and and see how I also use Gcash to pay my other bills so I hope you find this very helpful and uh, if you are new to my channel please do subscribe and uh, thank you so much for watching see you on the next video bye bye